Welcome back to Fallout New Vegas. My name is Ricky and this is Jesse. This is a challenge run where we are not taking any perks, sort of, and we are not directly increasing any of our skills permanently. Last week, we shotgunned a bunch of fiends in the arm and then also the face. And then we Andrew ryan to Mr. House, all for a sweet, sweet, sweet achievement. This week, we're gonna just explore the areas around New Vegas and see if anyone needs our help. So last week was a pretty short episode. It was like eight minutes or something. I didn't realize it was going to be that short when I was recording the episode because I recorded for a normal length of time. I recorded for a little over a half an hour, which usually means the episode's going to be somewhere between 15 and 20 minutes. And that's where I like to sit. And I didn't realize how much of that episode I was actually cutting out when I was recording it. I just didn't even think about it. So today we're going to try and do a lot more than we did last week. Also, here's a fun fact. That achievement I got last week for the one star GRA challenge has a 1.7% completion on Steam. 1.7% of players have that achievement. It's slightly better on GOG where it's 2.1%. I don't know, the whole thing is kind of weird. Anyway, so here we are in the uh, Aerotech office park thing. There was a quest I was going to do here and I can't remember what it's called. But no one's here. So I'm gonna wander around until I find the person I'm supposed to find. Maybe you could give me a hand. Sure. Some people have gone missing from the camp lately. I haven't seen any signs of violence or heard about any feuds. They just up and vanished. Okay. And I've also got Keith and his gambling to deal with. I know that skunk's cheating folk out of their savings. I just can't prove it. What can you tell me about the missing people? They never seem to have much in common. That's why I didn't notice it sooner. Young folks, old folks, men, women, all disappearing. I remember a family with a little blonde girl. She never talked much, but she always carried this little stuffed teddy bear. Can you remember anything else? I seem to recall a lot of them did business with those scavengers over on the west side, Dermot and St. James. But now we gotta go to west side. And so let's go over there. I have not even been anywhere near West Side. Just real quick, I don't know if I've talked about it, but we are absolutely under no circumstances ever, ever doing Bleed Me Dry. That's a nightmare of a thing. Um, I just think everyone should know that. Take that, you stupid fiend. Um, just in case anyone was wondering, we are never, ever, ever doing that awful quest. It is terrible and unpleasant and unfun, and I don't want to do it. Here we are, west side. The resident. And another resident. Also, this is the way I need to go. Yeah, there we go. Casa Madrid. But that's not who we're talking. We're, first, we're coming over here to talk to St. James, who is not... When I talk to a girl, I start the conversation, and I didn't start no conversation with you. Ooh, ooh, I don't like you already. Some people have gone missing, and they were last seen dealing with you. I don't know a thing about no missing refugees from that Aerotech camp. Go cry to somebody else. Didn't say anything about Aerotech. Yeah, well, I must have heard rumors. Well, I don't like you, so I'm going to kill you later. I just want you to know that I'm going to kill you later. Hi, right, giant super mutant. You say so. So, I don't actually know where his room is. The great this is signing a treaty not his inside. room, also not I his room. Seen that coming. St. James room key is a value of one. And I think I can grab it off of... Nope. There we go. 20 tries later. No, actually like four. Still. But now I have the key to get in there. I'm sure I could have gotten it some other way, but I like basically spamming saves to get keys and whatnot. So, okay, so. No. Oh, um. Stop detecting me, Dermot. Thank you. He doesn't have anything on him. Well, I'm going to take his ledger nonetheless. Okay, let's read his ledger, because I don't think it's going to be good. Dermot's ledger. Going to be a little different than the one I kept hauling scrap. Ha ha, but I've always been strong, believing, keeping straight books. Motor runner. Teen girl, 500 caps. Adult man, 38. Zero caps. Okay, so this is bad. I mean, good thing Motor Runner's dead, because 
they can't do this anymore. 50 cat. Oh, that's not good. Okay. So the teddy bear belongs to, is now in St. James's place. Wait, hang on. That sounded weird. I didn't actually mean for that to be like a, a Monopoly reference. Okay. There is no confront. There's no confront. There's kill. There is no confront. There is only kill. We can't let these guys be anything other than... Um... Okay, well this time I'm going to shoot him in the head a bunch. There we go. I hope no one minds I just, you know, killed him. It could be awkward. Eh, we seem good. So this can be kind of tricky, talking to him. Um, and so sometimes it takes like five or six tries to get him to actually talk about it. Have you found out what happened to those... There we go. St. James and Dermot were behind it. They're dead now. How do you know? Did you find proof? I found this evidence in the rooms. They attacked when I confronted them. They did not, but oh, I just bastards. shot them. Can't say I'll shed any tears for them. Here, you've earned this. Cool. Well, let's go see what's going on with Keith. Just cuz. I don't think I've ever actually wandered around this place before. I mean, I always knew it was an office park, but it is an office park, isn't it? Well, let's just talk to him, I guess. See what's going on. I've heard the Legion's planning to unleash their best men against us. Eh, we'll see. Hey there. Oh, uh, <laughs> boy, I sure could use some drugs. You know, anybody sells drugs. Let me just see what we can do. I got Benny's suit, which puts my barter up by five. Is that... I got this, which puts my barter up to five. Hey there. Fan... Nope, okay. Uh, I have a salesman weekly, so we're good. Okay. We're going to do it a different way than I normally hey do. There. Fancy. Uh, gambling's not my scene. Maybe you could hook me up with something medicinal. Oh, I get you. Looking for a slightly more chemical thrill? Absolutely. Okay, I'll tell you what. Um, sure, I'll take it. And here you... Bye. I think I may be able to sell the jet for more than 35 caps. I don't know. But that way, I don't arouse suspicion when we come back and kill him. Good to see you. Some... I've got evidence. Keith is selling drugs to the locals. Son of a bitch. I knew he was involved with drugs. <sighs> I know. Thanks. This gives me the evidence I need. Here. You've earned this. I'm gonna go take Keith into custody. If you're interested in a little extra pay, I wouldn't mind backup. Sure. I'm in. Why not? Yeah, yeah. Let's go. So, um, just in case you're wondering, I don't think he's gonna go quietly. Keith. The name of the there we go. Placing you under arrest for the sale of unlicensed cams. I ain't going nowhere with you. Come quietly now. I don't want to have to hurt you. Why don't you go cry to your wife then? Oh, that's right. She left you with the stinking ass. You son of a bitch. The fiend leader shouldn't have messed with our they great the army. The um. That fiend leader shouldn't have messed with our Never mind. Those cons are savage. Handyman jumpsuit. That's what he had on him. No, I just wanted the stem pack. Well, that was a bit messier than I would have liked. Is there anything else? No, I'm good. Uh, just a matter of my extra pay. Here you go. I promised you an extra reward for coming along, so that's what you get. I don't know if it was excessive in the Fallout universe, I'll be honest with you. We've now come to the North Vegas Square. I'm looking for him. Can I help you with something, stranger? Need a hand with any trouble? You want to help us out? Yes. What makes you think we want you around here, huh? Um... I'm the best there is. I respect your independence, and I'm good at taking care of troubles. That's the kind of stuff I like to hear, stranger. Do you not know who I am? We could use someone like you. With a courier. What do you want me to do? Some squatters decided to take space where they don't belong over by the playground. Okay. We prefer to keep them off the streets and out of sight. Maybe you could go and talk to them. Convince them to see things our way. Sure. I'm on it. I like your speed, stranger. Let me know when that's done. Will do. You, I need to talk to you. What do you want? Get lost. Brandon says you're not allowed to stay here. You gotta go somewhere else. Oh, really? And how are you gonna make us? Um, uh, my speech of 45. I'm asking nicely. I only do that once. Hey, hey, don't worry. I was just kidding. We're going, right, boys? Bye. Have you taken there care we go. Of squatters? That's good to hear. 
Can't ever be too careful with That's strangers fair. around here. Got any more work for Good me? Work with those newcomers. I think you can handle more serious business. Cool. More serious rewards. There's a handful of greasers down in the sewers causing trouble. They ain't packing too much iron, but I'd like them dealt with all the same. Okay. I'll deal with them. Glad to hear it. Let me know when they're gone. Cool. Guess we're gonna go sewer diving. I think I've only done this quest once. So I only vaguely remember it. Okay, I think these are the people I'm supposed to be talking to. Yeah. You guys are not greasers. What the hell are you looking at, punk? Not a greaser, that's for sure. I hear you've been causing trouble. Hang on. Okay. So. I have... The Naughty Nightwear, which gets me up to 55. And then... I don't know if I have a meeting people. I don't know if I have a meeting people. I don't. Okay, let's try this again. What the hell are you looking at? No need for violence. Make it worthwhile. Here's a hunter caps. Get out of here. That'll do. I just, I can't, I'm not. Have you run off those greasers? I took care of them. Great work. I gotta make sure this place doesn't eat itself from the inside. Sure. Anything else you'd like me to do? You know, this time I may actually need a gun with a brain. Talk to Mrs. Hostetler. She's near the Crimson Caravan. I think her daughter's making bad friends. Uh-huh. The kind that'll slit your throat in the dark. Ugh. I'll go see her. I like your enthusiasm, stranger. Oh, hey, look. Can't do anything. We leveled up, but as uh thing before, we just just can't do anything about it. Hello. What are you doing here? Get out before I blow your head off. Whoa, 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 whoa! Crandon sent me. He did, huh? All right. What do you want? Crandon said you had a problem. I take care of problems. If you're good at snooping around, then I could use you. I need to find out what my daughter's up to. Okay. She's been frequenting the square in North Vegas. Okay. Probably hanging out with street scum. I want to know more about her new friend. Okay. I'll check them out for you. I'm looking for Alice Hostletter. Alice. Oh, yeah. I've seen her around here much too often as of late. I reckon she's been hanging out with Andy and his crew. Hey. You know where I might find him? Try the gray. Beats me why people go into that forsaken thing. At least with huts and sewers, you know they ain't crumbling on top of your head. In the building named the gray, which I'm guessing is this building. This weird gray concrete building that does look like it might fall down at any minute. Although I guess it's been standing for uh, just a little over 200 years. Well, more than that, but since the bombs dropped. Looking for Alice and Andy. Oh yeah? What for? I just want to talk to them. Maybe they don't want to talk to you. Maybe they ain't here anymore. Maybe you ask too many questions. Maybe I shoot you in the head. And you know what? Screw it. I like where this is going. This escalated way quicker than I expected it to, but you know what? Fine. Andy's room key. Bottle caps and some jet. Who's shooting at me? Could you not? Just. Jeez. Just like. Oh, why do you all have keys to Andy's room? That's weird. Let's snoop around here. Henchman message to Andy Scab. What does this say? Hoss letter man always carries a full pouch to their house every night. Same pouch empty. Make sure Alice is a good doggy first and then do whatever you... Oh, ooh. Everything about that was gross, and I don't like it. What are you looking at, huh? You're Answer a ghoul. Me, or I'll get triggered. Uh, what are your plans for Alice? You think I give it? You're manipulating her into betraying her family. Family's just what the world throws on our shoulders without our say or opinion. Wow, that's you think dark. think Alice cares about her family? But first, let's tie up loose ends. Oh, boy. This, on the other hand, did not escalate so quickly. This was very intentional. On the plus side, I now have three copies of Andy's room key, so there's that. Back off. I know how to use this gun, and I'm not afraid to shoot if you try anything. I will kill you I'll where you stand. Long enough. No more. I'll, I'll kill them if they get in my way. What's going on it's in there? Payback time. That's what. They've got no right to screw me over, and I'm tired of it. Alice, Andy's you just using you to get to the money. What are you talking about? Andy wants to help me leave this hole, doesn't he? No. Look at the note I found in his room. That, that son of a bitch. I'll take the money and I'll kill him. Whoa, he's dead. Do you have the money? She's guarding it. I know she is. She locked the bedroom door like that's going to stop me. I was, 
I've got a gun. I'm gonna make her give it to me. I don't like where this is going. Yeah, okay. I'll shoot the lock off the door. I can't do it. Oh, okay. good. She deserves it and worse, but I can't hurt my own mother. Give me the gun, Alice. Fine. Take it. But what the hell am I supposed to do now? Stay with your family. Reconcile with them. Maybe you're right. But what will they think? How can I look them in the face ever again? I don't again? care. Well, I guess I don't deserve any better, huh? So be it. I was blind to what was happening in my own family. We don't have much. But please take this. Doesn't your husband run drugs for the great cons? Goodbye. You're going to leave? Just like that? I'll was there something else? Well, we helped out some more New Vegas citizens here. Thankfully, we stopped a human trafficking ring. And to top it all off, we reunited a daughter with her parents. And I think that is, that is the best we could possibly ask for. This has been Fallout New Vegas. Thank you for watching and come back soon for more New Vegas.